the whole draft year, there was lots of talk of one or two, and then when we got closer to the draft, um, Atlanta had actually told me that they were going to take Kovalchuk, so there wasn't a lot of suspense that way uh, leading up. The Islanders actually held the number two pick, so I had met a lot with the Islanders, and there was lots of rumors about them trading it, uh, trading the number two pick. The Ottawa Senators trade Alexi Ashen to the New York Islanders in exchange for Zdeno Chara, Bill McCall, and the second overall pick in this year's draft, the next pick. When Ottawa made the trade and I, and I heard on the draft floor, I was actually you know, surprised because I didn't know. My parents and my agent knew the day before, uh, but decided not to tell me. And, in this day and age, that would never happen with Twitter and Facebook and all that jazz. But um, back then, they were able to keep it a secret from me, so it was you know, pretty raw and, and uh, shocking to me when it happened. And I was pretty excited getting drafted by a Canadian team and um, so close to home. Ottawa Senators select from Windsor Spitfires, Jason Spezza. The I think fans in Ottawa have to be very happy with that pick. You know, he's an Ontario boy. This kid can score goals, and the Ottawa Senators need that, and I think he's a real nice fit for that team. Your whole life, and early in your teams, you were uh, tabbed as a number one overall. Is it disappointing to be number two? No, I don't think so. My goal is to play in the National Hockey League, and it doesn't matter where, and uh, you know, I'm happy it's Ottawa now, and it's great for my family. It's close to home, and I can stay in Canada. When I look back on it, I uh, the only regret is that we didn't win because we had some great teams, but as a whole, the, the city was great. The, the organization always treated me first class. You know, it was a, it was a great you know, first half of my career.